Pleasant Goat Fun Class. Sports are fun. Badminton is easy. <laughs> hey there, goats! I'm here to challenge you guys! Huh? Huh? What is this? It's made of feathers. <laughs> We're playing badminton right now. And it's a sport that a group of two to four can play. And it's really fun. Badminton? There's actually a story about badminton. A long time ago, there were two brothers. The younger one lived on the mountaintop while the older one lived at its foot. One day, the older brother wanted to give his younger brother some cherries he had grown. But a wolf spider blocked the way to the top of the mountain. Uh, what the? Hey, did you do that on purpose? I'm sorry. I just wanted to give my brother some cherries. I didn't mean it. Ah, try using this frying pan then. Ha, uh, uh, thank you. The older brother used the pan to hit the cherries, but they wouldn't fly right. Then he came up with an idea. He added a tail made of feathers to the cherries. With the feathers attached to them, the cherries flew right over the spider web and into his brother's hands. And then, the two brothers quickly took a liking to this new sport, and they decided to name it Badminton. That's an interesting legend. Badminton is so fun. But cherries taste so good. We mustn't waste them. Well, nowadays, badminton shuttlecocks use cork instead of cherries. That way, no food is going to be wasted. That's great. The mixed doubles badminton tournament is about to begin right now. Everyone, please take your positions. <laughs> <laughs> I'm an expert at singles matches. You're never gonna beat us. Let's play and see how good you really are. <laughs> the match begins now. Singles matches, I won't lose. Wow, that was great, Wesley. <laughs> yeah, let's keep it up. <laughs> the Pleasant Goat team has great coordination. The score is now tied. It's time for my final skills. Wesley wins the point. It's a foul. Wolfie is out. Oh, yes. I'm out. Hold on. Didn't the shuttlecock land in their court? During a match, if the shuttlecock hits the court's walls, or the ceiling, or the roof, that counts as a foul. Hey, Wolfie, <laughs> is that a mechanical hand you have on? <laughs> oh, Wolfie, you're cheating? I must disqualify you from the game! I'll never do it again! Remember, in a doubles match, coordination comes first and skills come second. Both players huh? must work together. <laughs> I'm not going to lose <laughs> next time. <laughs> we will give our best in the next match, too. Whoever can grip the racket correctly and hit shuttlecocks with it will be crowned the badminton king. Let me give it a try. Uh, uh. Your grip is too forward. This affects the angle you can hit with. This grip is incorrect. I want to try too. Oh. Ah! Extending your index oh. finger increases your chance of injury. This grip is incorrect too. Let me give it a try. Ha! <laughs> Amazing! The badminton king has officially been crowned. It's Wesley! 
The best grip is as close as possible to the handle. This way, you'll have more power to hit the shuttlecock. All right, kids, did you get all of that? Don't forget, on your first time playing badminton, remember to grip the racket tightly. We'll see all of you again next time.